सो वंस इन एन इंटरव्यू आई वॉज आक्स टू एक्सप्लेन द डी इन सॉलिड विच इज विच स्टैंड फॉर डिपेंडेंसी इन वर्जन सो जनरली वेन एवर इन माई करियर आई वॉज आस्ट टू एक्सप्लेन डिपेंडेंसी इन वर्जन वॉट आई यूज टू एक्सप्लेन वॉज डिपेंडेंसी इंजेक्शन विच इज मोस्ट प्रोमिनेंटली यूज इन स्प्रिंग फ्रेमवर्क ऑफकोर्स इट इज अ ग्रेट थ्रिंग वेयर यू नो द कंटेनर डिसाइड्स विच डिपेंडेंसीज टू इंजेक्ट इंस्टेड ऑफ यू नो हार्ड कोडिंग डोज डिपेंडेंसीज इन द एक्चुअल क्लासेस so this is dependency injection and i used to think that these both things are absolutely same well generally we can say that dependency injection is you know one of the implementations of dependency inversion or it is pretty much similar like dependency inversion but it is not exactly dependency inversion dependency inversion is the one of the solid principles it was introduced by famous architect robert c martin who is also known as uncle bob now this dependency inversion principle says that higher level modules should not depend upon lower level modules and instead of depending on lower level modules they should depend upon abstractions of lower level modules which means your classes should not depend upon other classes but instead they might depend upon the interfaces that those other classes implement for example your your controller should not depend upon your implementation service classes and your implementation service classes should not depend upon implementation repositories instead your controller can depend upon an interface which your service class implements similarly your service class can depend upon a interface that your repository implements and another important point here is that abstraction should not depend upon dependencies whereas dependencies should depend upon abstraction which which in simpler terms means your interfaces should not depend upon your implementations but your implementations should depend upon your interfaces they need to adhere to the protocol the method signatures the return types whatever is defined in the interfaces so implementation is dependent on interfaces and interfaces are not dependent on implementations so by adhering to dependency inversion principle you encourage decoupling make your system more flexible easier to maintain and easier to change so the dependency injection which is used in spring is just you know one of the implementations of the dependency inversion principle it is not like completely equivalent to the dependency inversion principle i hope do you like this explanation of the slight difference between these two topics we will continue to bring you such unique interview questions which you will never find anywhere on youtube these are absolutely unique and based upon my 14 years of experience as a java engineer i hope you like our content if you like please 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 show your support take a screenshot of the video post it on on your it on your linkedin twitter whatever social media you use more frequently please try to spread this channel more and more and help us achieve the desired result for which we put so much efforts thanks for watching